Hey guys, it's Louise here and welcome back to my channel. So today we have episode 6 of Andor, which is called The Eye, which is funnily enough the same title as the most recent episode of The Rings of Power. So from this, I from from the evidence that I've collected, uh, Cassie and Andor is Sauron. That's just how it is. Um, yeah, I'm excited for this. Um, we're finally, I think, getting down into the action um, of this episode, hopefully. Um, and... Yeah, we'll see we'll see where this goes. It seems to be this is the longest episode that we've had so far. So um I'm a little bit nervous because I don't think most people are gonna make it out alive. So uh, I don't like that. I don't like that. Saying, Oh, it'll be fine, you'll sleep when it's done. Does he mean but sleep as an actual sleep or sleep as an be dead? They breed a sad combination of traits that He was a stormtrooper. Really? Really? Pick it up! It'd be best if we split these up between us, eh? Oh, shit. Well, that's not fucking good. Come and look at this sash. Uh. None of this was stolen properly. It's all compressed. Perhaps you've expanded? <laughs> Perhaps you've expanded. Where's his Imperial blood? That transfer leave this stinking planet, you certainly whine about it enough. Colonel Pettigal will be It's with all the assholes in this show, man. Their best behavior. Fucking men. I look forward to seeing that. This is why women need to love women. This is actually like making me anxious already. We trade goat hides for a three-year lease, so they didn't smell so bad. Goat hides? No! The Darnies have a rough appetite for fragrance. Yes, I've been warned. Dude, if I was doing that shit, I'd be, I'd be messing everything up. I'd be trying to get stuff and I'd just be... I'd just be fucking up. Sorry, they're shutting down right now. Everything's grounded. No one wants to be up in this. Jesus Christ, seeing her running from there. Oh my god. This is terrifying. It's so terrifying. Echo one. Echo one. Echo one. Answer him, god damn it! Valley one. Valley one it go. Call it. Are we going or not? My heart. Go. We go. Copy. Uh. That was so scary. Got a bad in the first place. Drop it. On the floor. What's all this? <laughs> Drop it, damn. <laughs> Where's that tanner gone? Down. On the ground. Down. What is the meaning of this? Free fire! Oh, God. Move. Let the boy go! Don't point the gun at the boy's fucking head! Oh, God damn! Okay. I can never get out of here. Shut the fuck up, bitch. We're good. Starts now. Why do I feel like I believe him? I feel like he... I have anxiety now that he doesn't know how to do it. thing that makes me tear up. Oh my god, confirmed. Confirmed what they suspected last week. Confirmed! They both better make it out alive and they better kiss. Are you I having trouble with your comms? Swear to god! But everything else is fine. Weird, right? Must be the eye. Yeah, blame the eye. Blame Sauron. Oh, these dudes are just enjoying themselves, man. 
<laughs> they don't know what the, their shit's about to get fucked up. God, they're fucking good at everyone under control, aren't they? Holy shit! Let's fucking go! Don't turn away from them. <gasps> shit! Oh, God, no! Fuck! Shit! Oh! Fuck's sake. Let's hope that he, like, realizes, like, oh, I want to join you guys. It's fine. And this is where people are going to start dying. God, I love seeing the intensity of all this. It's incredible. It's not good for my heart, though. Oh, my God. That's so pretty. Oh, that music. Oh, wow, dude, what the fuck? Almost home. Everyone should go home. I was afraid you'd be leaving. We need to He's like, wait, wait, Gordon is in on this? He's like, what? He's gobsmacked. You. Seven years serving you. I deserve worse than that. Are we good? Oh. Go? We're good. Okay, come on, come on. Oh, my God. Oh, that is beautiful. Oh, this is very Squadrons-esque. Oh, my God. Ah, no. Oh, my God. Are you crazy? Just leave it. Fuck. You're off your post, Corporal. Tell him he needs to leave. Come on, your family. Huh? Your family. What is going on here? Ooh, ooh, ooh. I feel like this is gonna go bad for him. Please. Oh, that's. Oh my God, the tie fighters. Oh. The... Come on, get him, get him, you can do it! Oh, nice shot! Fuck! Oh, nice! Fucking let's go! Incredible shot. Holy shit. Oh! No! No! I thought he was. Oh, I thought. I can't feel my leg. I can't. I can't feel my leg. Dude, that's incredible to fly through, though. Holy shit. Oh god, he's incredible doing this. I want to cry at just how beautiful it looks. Oh my god, this is fucking Star Wars! <laughs> Forearms creeps me out. It's weird. As long as he can help him. Forty million apiece. Don't tell me you haven't thought about it. 
See, I can't find a trawler, but I do have a safe place we can hole up. Wait, does he want to ditch the other two? Between the two of us, we could be the winners here. Whoa! They really are assholes, all of them. You're a rebel, huh? Are you everybody up? You're a solo rebel. There's no way Cassian would leave them. There's no fucking way. Nuh-uh. Oh, fuck! <laughs> oh my god, I wasn't expecting that! Fuck! Jesus! Why did nobody else hear that? No, why is he too why? I said to keep this to you. I don't want it. You insist? Don't worry. You'll be fine. You'll sleep when it's done. God, I fucking knew that they wouldn't make it out alive, but yet when they managed to escape, I was like, oh, it's gonna be fine. Excuse me. Aldani. Big rebel attack last night, that's all we need. <laughs> yes! <laughs> oh, the relief on him, bless him. I mean, he doesn't realize most of them fucking died, but you know, it's fine. Oh my god. Ugh. Holy shit. That, uh, that episode was insane. That episode is one of the best episodes that I've ever seen in Star Wars. Like, some of those, some of that cinematography, some of those scenes, some of that, like, like, that was, that was the best thing. One of, one of the best moments I've ever seen, like, in Star Wars. The, the TIE fighters and the, like, the eye, like, everything in the sky and stuff, and the, the extreme tensity, like the intensity, you know what I mean, of the episode, like it was, there wasn't a moment of that where my heart was not racing because every single moment they managed to make incredibly tense, like even switching um, to the the group that were singing and then switching back to like, you know, the, the rest of the main group, even that was tense because like they're, they're like chanting and they're singing was like starting to like sort of speed up a little bit and get a little bit more intense. As like the scenes were getting a little bit more tense as well, and oh my god, it was just incredible. Um, I fucking knew that people weren't gonna make it out alive. Uh, stormtrooper guy, uh, was so shocked that he was a stormtrooper, but I find that very interesting. Um, that we have another character that was once a stormtrooper that has now left. Um, and I am very very sad about uh about Nemec. Um. I thought he was making it out alive. I thought maybe he had a chance. And then, of course, shit happened. And I was like, oh, fuck. And then he went to the doctor. And I was like, okay, well, maybe he'll be fine. Maybe, you know, maybe he'll just end up being, you know, being disabled. But he'll be alive. So that's that's fine. I'm so fucking sad. I'm so sad. He was such a cool character. I expect him to die. But he's so, I'm so upset. He was really, really cool. Um, Skeen. What a fucking, what a dickhead. What an asshole. Um, he deserved to be shot. Like, I, I kind of felt he was a bit sus, but I didn't expect him to just be like, hey, why don't we just ditch these ones and just, like, you know, call it splits and go. I feel like if Cassian hadn't been there, he would have just killed the other two anyway and just gone. Like, I'm so fucking glad that Cassian was there. Otherwise, the other two would have been, like, killed by him. Um, uh, I really, really hope that we get to see a reunion because they left, they left Gorn and they left Val. Val? 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 No, Vel's the Vel's the blonde haired one. Sintra. Sintra. They left Sintra. They left her. Um and Gorn. And I'm like really, really hoping that they had a plan. Like they had another plan to get out of there. Um and I hope that uh Vel and Sintra can uh you know, reunite again and maybe we get uh, our first proper Star Wars uh LGBT kiss. Because the one from the Rise of Skywalker does not fucking count. Um, I would be very, very, very sad if they killed off either one of these characters because it's, like, actual rep that we have. Um, 
And no, it's not woke. It's none of this bullshit. It's fucking good for the LGBT community to have characters subtly, you know, in the show. Like, it's not in your face. It's not, like, forced. It's actually really sweet. And I really, really like them together. And honestly, Sintra could become a favorite character because I think, like, with her with a fucking gun is hot and badass as fuck. And I love her. I think she is awesome. Um, she, She'd get on well with Dr. Afra, honestly. Hmm. Um, yeah, no, I, I, I really fucking loved this episode. I thought it was absolutely incredible. And if there's people still complaining, then that's on you. You're missing out severely because this is fucking insane. That was such a good episode. One of the best things I've ever seen in Star Wars. And I'm going to be like crying over the, the eye scene for the rest of the night. Um, and that is a hundred percent goes my wallpaper, especially the one with like the shot of that in the background and then the TIE fighter. Like, the, oh my god, that was so Squadrons. Like, that felt like it could be cover art for Star Wars Squadrons. Um, that was absolutely insane. Absolutely incredible. Um, yeah, I I absolutely loved it. I thought it was great. Um, but yeah, thank you guys for watching. Let me know what you think down in the comments. And make sure you subscribe for more Star Wars content. And I will see you guys uh, next week. So, peace and may the Force be with you.